Hello, my name is Roman Mironov, and welcome to another video review of a Mega Team. This video focuses on just one feature, but this feature is so important, and it is the ability to resolve conflicts during team projects in a Mega Team 3.1. I open two instances of Omega T and will now download the same project in both instances. Alright, both local projects downloaded and now I can proceed with the translation into German. One of the versions I translated two segments in one of the projects and now I will save it. Well, actually, it's already synchronizing itself, so it was saved. As soon as I move to this project and save it manually, the translation arrives. So, this is how it's supposed to work in a team project. In this left instance, I imitated the person who made the translation, and in this second instance, I imitated the person, the second translator, who actually did <coughs> no translation, but the translations were downloaded by Megati to his computer automatically as soon as they made it to the SVN server. Now, suppose both translators make a change to this one of the segments. They, one decides to use this translation and the other one decides to use another translation so they edit their segments okay and now both save the translations so it leads to a conflict okay, one saves manually and the other saves manually let's see what happens okay so both versions are synchronizing and we get this new window this new function is enabled by a program called Super TMX Merge, written by Aaron Madeline K. And what it does it is helping you to resolve this conflict. Here you have three choices. So you can use your translation, the the translation that you made. You can use the original translation that was stored on the SVN server. And here you can ch choose the updated version. So in this case I want to keep the original translation and so I select use all original and then I click done. And before I do this I want to show you that of course since this program is actually comparing the translations of course it shows the, the different changes made with different colors. Alright so I want to choose this option and I choose it and I click done and here's what happens in the version of the first translator the original translation Varnum is restored so let's see what happens to the version of the second translator it still has the old translation but when I save the project manually and have it synchronized with the SVN server the updated translation is fetched. And the idea behind this new function is of course preventing a Mega T from automatically overriding translations in case of such conflicts. So this new function actually puts the translators into the driver's seat by letting them choose which translation is the current one, the right one. It is yet another great step to improving the team project domain of Omega T. That's it. Thank you for watching and feel free to let me know if this video helped in some way.